Hey everyone, this is Jeanette with Ma Misters. Uh, welcome to my sneak preview today. I am really excited to share a lot of this stuff with you. This is um, the pre-order from the new catalog. This is the new catalog right here. And it's got some really, really awesome stuff in here. And I'm really excited to show you some of this stuff. This is the back of the catalog. Unfortunately, I cannot show you what's inside, but I can show you some of what um, I have and have ordered and received from this catalog. As demonstrators were allowed to do a pre-order and mine came in today. So with my pre-order, I got the in color cardstock and there are five colors here. We have um, a pink can't think the name of it right off the top of my head. And we've got Lemon Lime Twist. And this is Berry Burst. And this was um, Tranquil Tide. And this one is um, fresh fig, and there's the in colors. And then we have, um, let me look up the new color on that one so I can tell you really quickly what it is. It is called Powder Pink. Pink is powder pink. And then these are the ink pads, the in color ink pads. This is the Fresh Fig, the Tranquil Tide, and then this is the Lemon Lime Twist. Okay. And then also in my pre order, I only got a couple of them. The rest are, is, hasn't come in yet, but these are the ink refills. Anytime you order any of the in colors, I recommend you getting the refills just to save you from having to worry about getting it later on and not being able to get it. Uh, let me show you another paper pack. This is called Wood Textures and it is 6 by 6 paper and this time it's different because Stampin' Up! did not bind the top edges to prevent that residue that was at the top. But it's double-sided paper. This is one side of it. This is the other. And then there's this one. And the flip side of that is this. I think it's really neat. I really like it. And then there's this one. This one reminds me of paneling or the wood floors in your house. I think it's really neat. More like paneling to me. There's that one. And then this is the lighter shade of it. And then there's this one. It's really, really pretty. And I think that's this one I have here. No. Okay, and then there's this one. And that's the flip side to that. And then there's this one. And that's the flip side to that. And then we have this one. I think that's really cool. And then the flip side to that. And then we have... There's four of each one. This one. And that's the flip side to it. And then we have... This one. And that's its flip side. And then we have this one, and that's its flip side. And then we have this one, and that's its flip side. And then this one, and its flip side. And I'll show you something cut with that here in just a second. Let me put this away. So, and then I got 
some of the enamel shapes. These are the 20, the in color dots. These are the glitter enamel dots, and they're really, really pretty. Um, it's the camera doesn't do justice to it when you see it in person. It's really, really pretty. And then these are the clear faceted gems. These are clear, and these are the gold. They're really pretty too. And then we have um, a bundle. I'll show you a bundle. And this is the Label Me Pretty bundle. And it comes with a punch. And I'll show you an example of something that I... This is what it does. This is this punch, right? the stamp right here. And then you can just cut it out punch it out it's really pretty and on this I used Tranquil Tide so that's that bundle and then this is another bundle this is called Dairy Delight this one also comes with a punch and on this one I uh, this is what the the punch flowers look like they're pretty good sized they're um, maybe almost two and a quarter wide, and they are uh, probably about that tall. And then this is one of the little flowers that I um, stamped with it. It's a two-step flower. It's this one right here, and I stamped it with the outline, that darker color with rich raspberry, and then inside was sweet sugar plum. And then this is the stamp daisy. Unfortunately, it has my fingerprints on it, but I'm not too worried about that because I think punching it will get rid of that. And then all you have to do is line up the punch, which I don't know if I'll be able to do right here, and I don't want to take a lot of your time trying to line that up. But, oh, I think we could, might have got it. Okay, and then you can do a couple of these and then layer them. Then you could put one of those gold faceted gems in the center of that. It's a really cute stamp set. And then we have this stamp set here. It's called Crafting Forever. And I just did a quick stamp of the bucket of paint brushes, and that's what that looks like. It's really cute, just ready to be colored in, and then you could pop it up on some dimensionals and or um, cut around it with the stitched framelits. It's really cute. I can hardly wait to, to do this one. I'm going to do a card with this one and send it to my customers. And then there is this step set. And it is part of a bundle. It is called Colorful Seasons. And it's got some leaves and snowflakes and falling leaves and flowers and just everything for every season and this is um, the chair this little chair it's a two-step stamping and this is what this chair looks like right here it's really cute really easy to line up and this one also comes with some finlets that will um, that coordinate with some of the stamps but then it also has individual things like this little Adirondack chair. And this is that chair that I cut out with this using that wood crate paper. And that's what that looks like. And then the other side is the, re the reverse paper. I think it's really cute. And then you could cut it out in different colors like green or red or whatever you want to do. And that's that one right there. And then there is another bundle. 
that is called um, At Home With You. And this is a stamp set for that. And then these are the framelits that go around for that. And it's got the door, um, the potted plants, a little lantern, the window. It's got the garland for around the house and a wreath. Just really, really cute stuff. And this is, um, I went ahead and just stamped the one of the little potted plants. This is the tree, just so you could see what it looked like. And then I stamped the door so you could see what that looked like. I can hardly wait to use this one. And with the, the dies, you can actually, um, it'll cut the door out. And then there's another insert right here. This one, this one right here will cut the door out. And then you put this one in and it'll cut the inside of the door. So you can actually open the door and stamp a sentiment in there. And I think the font on the sentiments are really, really cute. And then I have another one that I want to show you. And this one is another bundle. And this one is um, Wood Words, which I don't have the stamp set for because by the time I ordered it, it was on back order. And I'm expecting that to come in in the next couple of days along with my other order. And then this one where you can make little crates to put candy or different things in and this one comes and there's a, a heart a half moon and there's this is a rooster and the star and what you do is you cut two of these and then you fold it and then you would put it together and it makes a little crate which I didn't do on that yet I haven't really experimented with this one yet and that completes that pre-order. And then I have one more thing to show you. And this is called the Eastern Palace Bundle. And this comes in two different options. One of the options is the paper. Um... Either the stickers or this, you get free note cards and the stamp set and your, your three end colors of ink. Which the other one is MIA. I'm not sure where I put that one. Oh, right here. And the three ink pads. I think with one of them, <clears throat> you get the stickers but not the tassels. <coughs> and that's the smaller bundle. And then with the bigger bundle, you actually get the framelits that go with this too. And the tassels or whatever is included in that one. And this is just some of the cutouts from the dies. They're really, really pretty. This is another one. And there's different ways to use them. Um, they will cut circles as one piece and then you can cut it apart and use it that way. You can um, leave them together and it puts, well, this is all of them together. Or you can leave these centers out and it leaves a place in the center where you can go ahead and stamp a sediment. And then you can, um, if you do this, it will cut the image in your cardstock, but it won't. Um, doesn't completely cut it out. If you want it completely cut out, you would use this. And I have some um, examples of this with some cards that I did. And the cards are... I'm not sure what I did with the cards. Let me look here really quickly. Oh, I can't show you the cards because I um, already packaged them in my catalogs to be mailed to send to my customers. And then um, this is a stamp set. And it's got 21 stamps in it. And you can see it's already kind of well loved for me. And then this 
These are the note cards you, you get. They're in very vanilla with a smaller bundle. And then these are the stickers. They're really, really pretty. And they're, um, some of are big, big, big stickers. And some you can actually take the centers out and use them as two different stickers. Let me see which one those are. Like these right here. These will actually come apart and you get two different circles in here where you could use this one and then stamp a sentiment in there and then you could use this one and that's a whole big one. And then it's got little um, border labels right here. And then you get the tassels along with that too. And then you get the 12 by 12 paper. And this paper is a specialty paper. And you get um, 12 sheets of paper in here. And it's two-sided. This is one side. And then this is a specialty paper. It's embossed. And you only get one of this, single-sided. And you get this one. It's the other side of that. And then this one. The other side of that. And then the screen. And the other side of that. And this stamp, this paper pack was actually inspired by the feathers of a peacock, which you can kind of see that right here. And then there's this one. And then I showed you that one. And then this is the other side. This is another one of the specialty papers that's embossed and it's single sided. And then you also get um, a paper pack with that that I didn't grab. Let me grab that really quick and I'll show you that. Sorry about that. And then this is the cardstock that you get with that that's actually part of the bundle too. Let's see if I can slit this open. I have one that's open, but I'm not exactly sure what that's at right now. I am going to be planning a class with this one here in the next week or so. I have to design the cards. And this is, you get the cardstock in both of the bundles. And this is the Fresh Fig cardstock. This is the Fresh Fig. And then included in this cardstock is um, Dapper Denim, which is this blue right here. It's a really pretty deep, rich blue. And then the last color is the Tranquil Tide. And this is part of both bundles, the big one and the small one. And then you get, like I said, the tassels. And these are the tassels. And that's gold, fresh fig, and tranquil tide. And that's all of this bundle, this pre-order that I got today. I'll be ex I'm expecting another pre-order to come in and I will show you those when I get them. But there again, um, the catalog goes active June 1st. And if you want one of these catalogs, I will be more than happy to send you one. All you have to do is place an order on my online store to get this, and I will send you a...